Hello everyone, uh, this is Pierce Calloway again, bringing you my faith and more fitness. We both need all of these things every day, not necessarily my faith, but your faith also shared with others. Guys, the scripture I'm going to bring to you today is in John 13.35. It says, By this everyone will know that you are my disciples if you love one another. And what I'd like to say to this guy specifically right now is, if we are recognized as Christians by our love, then remember, here's what I want to point out. Remember, love is the love that you find in 1 Corinthians chapter 13. Love is patient, it's kind, it doesn't boast. Guys, it does not mean you have to show others that you are accepting of their sin. That is not what Christ came to do, guys. Christ came to serve others, but that serving is supposed to be leading to repentance. Guys, that's what we need to understand, and the world doesn't understand at all. You love the person, hate the sin. The sin has to be removed. So when you love other people, that doesn't mean you should stop helping them to remove sin from their life. Guys, I, I, hope, that, I hope that's understood. Love doesn't equal acceptance of sin. If there's sin in my life and yours, we need to remove it. Love is how you deal with or how you treat people midst their sin. So Jesus Christ showed us love by dying for us on the cross. He came for us to repent of our sins and love others by the example he has given us. Guys, I, I hope that's understood. Remember, love does not equal acceptance. That's what I want people to understand. I love everyone and look up what love actually means in 1 Corinthians, people. Please, please, please. And guys, now for the fitness portion. What I'd like to show you is not an easy move at all, okay? These are called just a chest press with a combination of a jack knife um, sit-up. So right here, guys, is two exercises that are difficult by themselves but combined together, okay? So here, I'll hold the weight up. Here, I'll hold these down, and I want you to come up. Okay, so guys, again, my lower back, my lower back stays flush on the floor at all times. My legs stay up in the air, and I'm here coming up as high as I can. Your elbows will hit at a 90 degree angle on the ground. You're here. So guys, again, phenomenal exercise, and I want you all to try that. Logically, the heavier the weight, the greater the strength gain. But guys, start out with just your body weight. You do not have to use the weight if the jackknife abs are difficult for you anyway. Just go without the weight. And, uh, and try to touch your toes. 
So this, this without weight, guys. You can also go here and come up. That's if you cannot use the weight. Try to use the weight at first, but if it's too difficult, please don't. Okay? So guys, please share this with others. Subscribe so you're getting all the videos. And give me some comments. Include your prayer requests so that I can pray for you. Guys, I want to see not only the love of Jesus Christ spread into your life, but I also want to see some healing being done. I can pray for your healing and not even meet you. I believe that strongly, guys, that Jesus wants that for all of us. So thank you, and I'll continue to post, guys.